Why are there so many diapers for adults? Why is the majority of them colorfully printed? Why do adults and sometimes even teenagers still wear diapers at all? Isn't that just something for little kids? That's what this video is about. It may surprise some that there are some reasons why diapers are still worn by older children to adults. In some cases, this is a problem that should be solved, but in many, it is not. Let's start with what is probably still the most well-known issue, bedwetting. This mainly affects children and adolescents, from about 5 years old, children sleep through the night. Some do not notice it if they have to. Even though many are uncomfortable talking about it, it's not that rare, about 16% of 5-year-olds are bedwetters. This usually does not happen on purpose, but is part of development. It therefore also varies from child to child whether they wet the bed unnoticed several times a week or only a few times a month. In the vast majority of children this is not a disease and therefore not permanent, but a phase in growth that passes after some time. Since it is a great and unpleasant burden for parents and children when the bed gets wet again and again, diapers can help at night. And other aids such as a mattress protector, so that at least the mattress does not get damaged if it is tried in between times again without a diaper and it comes to accidents. Stress and pressure do not help, but can even harm. In a smaller proportion of children and also adolescents, bedwetting is not just a short-term phase during development. Rather, they have the problem for longer because it is triggered by psychological stress, bullying at school, family quarrels, drug addiction in parents, violence, divorce dispute are just a few examples. For some, even several problems come together, so it is no wonder if the body reacts with bedwetting or other effects due to this permanent stress. Again, there is no physical cause and the bedwetting can disappear again when, for example, the bullying stops or the family problems are sorted out. The second reason for wearing diapers are physical diseases. Here there is a wide range. It starts with, for example, cystitis, which can be caused by bacteria. This can be a one-time illness, but it can also occur more frequently. In case of incontinence, diapers are not only an aid, but often mandatory. It leaves you unable to control urine and or stool so without a diaper you're wetting your pants. A number of diseases, but also accidents can lead to this due to damaged nerves. One spectator, for example, had a serious bicycle accident and has been incontinent ever since. So something like this can happen to anyone. In the body, a finely tuned system is responsible for us noticing when we have to, and the sphincter muscle holds it back until we consciously let it out on the toilet. Again, there are many causes and types of incontinence. For example, some only lose urine during physical exertion, such as lifting heavy objects, coughing, laughing and other activities. Then, too, not everyone is completely incontinent. For many, it only affects urine. Fecal incontinence is less common. It is beyond the scope of the video to list all types here. In any case, these people can control their excretions either only to a limited extent or not at all. Diapers allow them to live a largely normal daily life without constantly wetting their pants, which would be uncomfortable in many ways. But why do the diapers have to be colorfully printed for this, sometimes even with toys and other childlike motifs? There are several reasons for this, the first is variety. Those who have to wear diapers permanently may find the often white medical diapers boring at some point. With underpants, after all, there are people who wear colored underwear or perhaps even underwear printed with motifs. Why shouldn't diaper wearers also have this option? After all, diapers are their underwear because otherwise they would leak. Otherwise, the colorful ABDL diapers are known for high wearing comfort and good absorbency, which many have proven in my practical tests. The quality is also better. For example, resealable adhesives are standard in the ABDL range, but not everywhere in the medical ones. Some therefore choose such diapers more for the quality than the look. The third reason is different. Here we are talking about a BDL, so adult baby, diaper lover. These people either want to be treated like a baby or a child, for different reasons. Some associate good memories of carefree childhood, when you didn't have to worry about anything. Or like the feeling of security. Others have experienced trauma or abuse, which they deal with in this way, the reasons are many and varied. Diapers are only one part of the process of feeling small. They often still have things like pacifiers, onesies, toys and other matching items. Diaper lovers are not interested in this and like to wear diapers. For some it is a fetish, i.e. a sexual preference, as there are plenty of other objects, for example sneakers and leather. 
It depends on the person whether one is just a baby or just a diaper lover. Some also like both, though the former is usually completely non-sexual. The last reason is again quite pragmatic. Comfort and convenience. This is another topic that people don't like to talk about, like everything to do with diapers in general. But some people wear diapers because it is convenient for them in some way. For example, several of my viewers and myself have worn diapers on the train. There, unfortunately, it is often not even so much convenience, but rather out of necessity. If you're traveling a long distance for several hours, you're going to need to use the restroom at some point, especially in the summer, when you need to drink more anyway. Often the toilets are unclean or even broken. What do you do then? There I was already glad that I could just let it run into the diaper and no longer have to worry about something like that. Similar things have also been reported to me by people who, for example, go diving or to concerts. Sometimes it's either not possible to go to the bathroom or it comes with disadvantages. Some players who play longer games with several people over the internet also find it convenient to no longer have problems with urination. Or in the cinema, when watching a complete feature film and perhaps drinking larger amounts at the same time. Of course, this is not for everyone and there are other ways. Some things are simply convenient, you can also get up and go to the bathroom while watching a movie. I think both are fine. How often do we opt for more convenient things at other points in our everyday lives that don't have to be? Confirming terms and conditions without reading them, car instead of bike, delivery service instead of cooking, and so on. Therefore, in my opinion, we should not condemn anyone for wearing a diaper out of convenience. And especially for people with smaller bladders who can't hold it as long, it's a greater relief. Even if it just takes the stress out of not having to worry about it. And again, you may choose a colorful printed ABDL diaper because of the quality and absorbency. Some may find the motifs appealing as well, why not? After all, if someone likes Simpsons, Pokemon or anything else, they can wear underpants or other clothing that features that. Anyway, these are the four main reasons why some teenagers and adults still wear diapers. First, bedwetting. Second, illness. Third, ABDL. And fourth, lack of clean toilets or convenience. Thus, diapers are not just for young children, as many may think if you are not in these four groups. If, on the other hand, you wear diapers yourself, for whatever reason, then you'll find more diaper videos in the margin on the left. Because that's what my entire channel is about. I test how good different diapers are in everyday life. You'll also find information, tips and tricks on the subject, such as this video in which I explain the reasons for wearing diapers. By the way, all the diapers you see here are from my archive. Whenever I test a diaper, I put the last piece of it in my archive so I can compare it to others and just make videos like this here sometimes. Are you interested? Then feel free to subscribe to this channel for free so you don't miss any future content. And feel free to write me in the comments how you liked this video.